So in this session we will be dealing with errors of sum or a difference. For that let us consider two values that is a and b which is equals to a real value and its absolute error delta a, a real value of b and its absolute error delta b. Now on adding both of these delta a, uh, a plus minus delta a and b plus minus delta b, we will be getting a resultant z. Suppose z with its errors delta z is the result of addition of first value and second value. Now writing real values aside that is a plus b and absolute errors aside delta a plus minus delta b we can say that this is your z and this will be our delta z. Now focus on this part error part. This error part can have two possible values. One is delta A plus delta B while other is delta A minus delta B. You should always go for delta A plus delta B because error should always be considered maximum. Always remember this. So whether you are subtracting or whether you are adding your resultant error that is delta z should always be delta a plus delta b. So our resultant would be z plus minus delta z for addition it would be a plus b plus or minus delta a plus delta b and for subtraction z plus minus delta z that is resultant of subtraction will always be a minus b plus or minus delta a plus delta b in both the situation your error part should always be an addition thank you